What up, fam? So, today we're heading for another day in the shearing shed. Since I did some video, Chels has been videoing. Go and check that out. The link will be in the description. Um, we've got a fair few sheep done. All the ewes are in the shed. But it'll be odd to our ewe lambs. Then we'll be done for the year. Hopefully by tomorrow about lunchtime. I got 10 that run, com compared to Brad who got 26. So if you think it looked like hard work for me, it was. It was also hard work for Brad, but he's very good at it. Shearing. <laughs> Shearing's one of those things, it looks easy to watch until you drag one out and have a go for yourself. And then it's very hard. Alright, we've had some lunch and now it's time to get in and to it again. If you can't tell, I'm just busting out of my skin to get into this. Finish the ewes and now we're on to the ewe lambs. These are a fair bit easier to shear because they're smaller and straighter, but they wriggle a lot and they're hard to hold on to. So it's all straight up. Anyway.
right, we're done for the day. Everyone else is going home. Alex is over here. Popper is out there. Backlining the last of the lamps. <sighs> we will get them all shone tomorrow, which will be very, very nice. Um, I was shearing today because one of the shearers called in sick, which is a shame. But anyway, it is what it is. Um, yeah, it's tough work. I take my hat off to anyone who's a shearer. You do good, better than I, because it's hard work. Um, yeah, see you tomorrow when we finish them off. What's out there, Alex? Can you see? What's in there? Yeah. Yeah, good waving. There they go. Back out to their paddock. Ready to eat some grass and grow bigger. Right guys, the next day I'm feeling super sore and I'm glad that the other shearer that was sick yesterday is back. Um, yeah, I fed our pet lamb. We've got a pet lamb now. Hopefully it survives. I fed it some milk this morning. Anyway, we're gonna finish shearing today. Alright, shearing lambs is a bit different to use. The wool's short and it falls apart. So Zoe was just picking it up off the floor and putting it on the table and Dad was sorting it out. Seems to be working alright. Um, now we're gonna count out the ones that Sean. All right, we got finished all the lambs and we just ran my five sheep through. Now we're on to Dad's weathers. They're just the lawnmowers around the place and then we'll be all done. This, the end is near. It's just fire. So what are you looking at in a fleece, Dad? Oh, I'm looking at the crimp there, all them little waves, how white it is, and the length, and how strong it is. So overall, that's a good fleece, that one. Alright, 
just finished backlining all the ewe lambs. Just about to let them out in the paddock with all the other ewe lambs. And they can eat some grass, have a drink and keep growing. guys all the sheep are back in their paddocks the shearing's done or oh, still a few stragglers but we'll pick that up um thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed it um yeah i don't know what else to say if there's anything else you want to know about shearing whack a comment down below I'll see if I can answer it. Um, yeah, I don't do a lot of shearing. I don't, as you can see, I'm not very good. I don't do a lot of work in shearing sheds. Um, but yeah, someone else might know something to answer your questions. Um, yeah, and to any of you local blokes who have seen me shearing and think that it might be a good idea to ring me up and ask if I'd shear for a day, don't do it. Don't waste your time. I'm going to say no, so uh, probably ask someone else, I would recommend. Rightio, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.